you're gonna two step? I don't know. Maybe. I mean, you can if you, you want. Can tell me what to do, and then maybe I'll do it. Um, so basically, you can in a normal tune, you can do it without a switch. I can do it without a switch. If I want to do it while I'm rolling, I just hit the switch so it thinks it's at zero. But yeah, I mean, if you want a two step at the rev limiter, it'll do it. Where's the rev limiter? Four and a half. You just hold it. What Jake does, he opens his car up, man. This is how he does it. This is how he too. Well, though, those of you who don't know what two step is, it makes. Big old bang bang. The car goes bang bang bang. Like that. But there's a little switch that does some magic. Right. Okay, get going. Your light doesn't even turn on. How do you know that this engages? Your light don't turn on. How do you know? Like, what if you accidentally hit that down and hit your tooth? So that. Okay, so this little switch here. I mounted myself. You flick your switch, yeah, yeah, you mount everything, don't you? And what does it do? Uh, you flick the switch down, and when you, when you rev it, how, how, how do you rev it? Oh my god. <laughs> okay, basically, there's a switch here, and what you want to do... That some magic! You want to go out to your piece of shit, Mark IV. Stop revving it. <laughs> um, Alex! Oh yeah, oh my yeah. And, um, so basically, you run two wires off the switch, and down here is your vehicle speed sensor. And you basically, there's three wires, and what you want to do is tap into the ground. And what you do is basically shut the speed off. And in a lot of tune, you know, in order to hit rev limiter or start with the launch control, the tune needs to know that the vehicle stopped, which means the vehicle speed is zero. So what you want to do is cut the ground, run a switch to the ground to turn it on and off. So while you're driving, you can two-step or any lag or whatever rev limiter your car's set up at. So if you hit this switch, yeah, you got, you really got to punch it like this. No, 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 you don't punch oh, anything. Fuck. We said to hit the switch. <laughs> so what do I do now? Are you gonna two-step? I don't know. I mean, you can if you want. Tell me what to do. Um, so basically you can in a normal tune you can do it without a switch I can do it without a switch if I want to do it while I'm rolling I just hit the switch so it thinks it's at zero but yeah I mean if you want a two step at the rev limiter it'll do it Where's the rev limiter? four and a half you just hold it <laughs> wow wow so yeah um, you know I have a tune for it can run up to 27 pounds with a bigger with the bigger turbo the internals are stock but I mean, I'm sick of people that get on my ass, so I ran a switch, so if they get too close to me, I hit the so switch. You wanna, you wanna talk about running 27 pounds of boost here on a stock turbo. Mm -hmm. That's not what you wanna do. <laughs> As okay. you can see. <laughs> this is what'll happen, yeah. We're also in the process of swapping turbos on a BMW. It's a twin turbo setup. It's got some, some wicked shaft play. Yeah, the other one is completely fucked. They're both fucked. This one, you can wiggle the insides of the turbos out. So if you guys want to see that, let us know. We still got a couple days worth of work, so just let us know. All right. Yeah. Thank you for watching.